Hello, this is Chris from Polytech and on this video we are going to learn how to create a footer for our site using the Astra team. To do that, we need to go over to the left, which is Appearance, we are going to click on Customize. Here we are now, we are going to click on Footer Builder and as you can see here on the bottom we have three rows, one with the copyright, that are the different footers. So if we click here we can see above footer and we are customizing the above footer on the general options we have columns which is the layout right here and here we can change the distribution equal more on the left, right, on the center and so on. If we increase or decrease the number of columns, this distribution will change accordingly. And now we have the inner elements layout, stuck or inline. And we can change it for the different resolutions by clicking here. The width of the content full width or content width the height of the footer can be increased here and the alignment to be vertical top the, the vertical alignment I mean could be top middle or bottom and we can hide it on the desktop and for the design we have Top border size, you can change it here. Background on the different resolutions. Inner column spacing on the different resolutions as well. And we can add padding or margin. And this can be, these configurations are mostly the same on the different options in the primary footer, above footer, and below footer as well. Now, once we have taken, taken a look to the general options and the design, we are going to add some elements to the above footer. So we click on the plus symbol and we can add the different options we could add, which is 1 to 4, social, HTML, 1 to, and menu footer. So we are going to add a menu holder as you can see this is the the menu we have created but if we click on the further menu we can configure the menu here so we click there and it's going to take us to the selection of the menu and we go to the further menu and select a menu for our further so we are going to go back to the footer builder and if we click we can change the layout on the different resolutions the alignment high on the desktop and on the design we can change the link text and the background as well for the hover for the active and as you can see, we can change on the hover and on the active. So we are on the home page, and on the hover is a bright shadow, which is not the best color I know. On the menu font size, we can change it here for the different resolutions as well, it could be PX or EN. And on the menu spacing, we can add some px as well. We could only the values here, and we can add some margin as well, and unlink it on the same manner and on the different resolutions as well. So we are going to keep going, and on the middle, we are going to add a widget, widget one, and we are going to click on it. And as you can see, we can add. A widget by clicking on add widget here and we can select different options 
that we have available. We are going to add some pages to it and we can give it a title. Sort it by page title order or ID or exclude certain pages from it. But since we already have this one, we are going to remove it and we have pages. We can change the alignment as well on the different resolutions and change the color of the title, the content color, and the link color as well. As you can see, it has a red and a blue on the hover, mostly like on the menu font size, content size, margin, and we can change it if it, it's in PX or EM for the font size and the content size. And on the last one, we are going to add the social icons. And if we click, we are taken to the customizing of the social icons. In, if we click, for example, on the Facebook one, we can change the label, add the URL, of course, and change the icons on the list of the awesome phones. We have plenty of options. And we can do so as well for the Twitter and the Instagram, or we could add different social medias here by selecting one and clicking add social icon. We can choose to show the label or only the icons. We're going to go with the icons only. The alignment, high on the desktop, and the design, we can change the icon size. On the different resolutions, the spacings between the icons as well on the different resolutions, the icon background spacing and the icon radius and on the color it could be the official or we can select a custom color for the different icons. And we have hover and normal and on the different resolutions. So we are going to choose blue and a red on the hover as in the different examples and we could do so in the same manner for the label but in this case we don't have the label on and for the background color as well and we could add so margin to it once we have made all the changes we want this can be made so for the different folders in the same manner we are going to the top left and we are going to click on the publish to save those changes so that's it we have learned how to create a photo for our site using the Astra team in a quick and easy manner if you like the video subscribe to our channel and share it with a friend who might help on the sites see you the next time on Polytech